Hey guys, so I've started playing a game called Hordeo, and it's where you attack pe uh, people on Bloodlust, like these people, and where you level up, and I'm level 40 right now, and you try to get as much fame as you can, and gain as many levels as you can. So you have the silver helmet, which um, means I got over 2,500 fame. So, let's go kill some people. And there are many pros out here, so I'm wondering if this is the original, because the original is very, very strong. So never mind, this is not the original one. I'm going to apologize ahead of time for any foul language on this chat, because I have no control over that whatsoever. And there, people can act a little rude and crude. So yeah, sorry for that. And let's see. What I'm doing right now is called spawn killing. It's when you just wait at the spawn and kill people on the other team. And alright, so I now have 3,591 fame. And my goal is to get the gold helmet, and this person's probably going to kill me. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, I'm not gonna get out of this one. There's no way I'm gonna survive this. Yep. I'm gone. But luckily, I gained this my silver helmet. So, now for an ad. I'll just accept that for a second so you guys don't have to like. more vulnerable because some people spawn kill and they but they cast a long range spell over the spawn area and it kills people at the spawn literally so it is spawn killing so well, I can totally take them and done I have to be careful around here, because somewhere around here there's someone on the leaderboard, and I prefer not to lose my helmet. So who are they? Um, oh yeah, that's good. I don't want to be killed by empty. So sprint. And right now my the levels on my things are all at 16. So that means, you know, these stats here show you know, the things, and each time you level up your skills, it costs more to level them up again. So I have to like, get 58,544 58, gold before I can level up again. These are only the skills, like, I, this is how much XP I have right now, and I need to get that much in order to get to level 41. I don't think I have to worry about losing my silver helmet because I have a pretty good amount of fame. At one point, I was rushing and getting fame, so I ended up losing a lot of it because. I was only level 35 then, and as you can probably guess, many people were above my level, so they could easily pick me out. And let's get out of here again, because that person's coming back in. Yeah, I'm just going to backpedal and show you. So I can take that, I think there was one that I took up before. So, look at that baby. That's my cat cat still. She likes sitting in my lap, but right now I'm really happy. I'm gonna die. I'm just gonna hold for a second. Let's see here. I'm just gonna assess the situation. See, this is how I survive in this game. I assess where I'm going. 
by going on one of these big hills up here. I'll show I'll give you guys a tour of this place. So you may have heard of like the game Splixio and Hort um no not Hortio because this is what I'm playing. Um and Limaxio or Slitherio, they were popular games a few years ago. And they came out with this, and this game's only in the alpha stage right now. I'm thinking, am I gonna run? No, I can kill them. Frenzy actually killed me once when a war was going on, so that was a very annoying experience. And it looks like Auntie's still there. And yes, Auntie has killed me quite a few times before I gained my wisdom. So, let's see, where to next? If my voice sounds a little weird, it's because I am catching a cold. One that everyone is going home for right now, and I'm in school. Alright, back up. I back up because I can't change world in battle, so let's go down to Theos. Trying to get one with a vanguard king because those places tend to be more secure. And if someone decides to spawn kill and gets too close, then the vanguard warden or the king will go after them and kill them. And the vanguard warden and king have very high health and very strong attack power. So, recommendation never attack them head on because they will kill you. Fame from that, and that's not that much fame. So, fame is what gets you on the leaderboard, obviously. And as you can see, Shorn Crunch has killed me many times, Para has killed me many times, and these blue guys, those guys are on my team, so I don't have to worry about them killing me. So, let's see. My goal is to get 5,000 fame, which gets you the gold helmet. Look at that, that's cute, they just leveled up. But I don't really care. So, Connor, I can attack them. So I can't attack people that are gray. Like, see, for example, <clears throat> oh, it's like none of them are out right now. But, in a case where the their gamer tag is gray, I can't attack them because it means that they're too low of a level <clears throat> for me. But once they reach level 8, that's when I can attack them. I think it's a matter of people, you know, popularity of the game. We want people to actually have a chance to, you know, level up a little bit before someone goes and kills them. See, they're level 8, so I can attack them. You see this level 1? I can't attack them. It's, it won't let me. I'm pressing 1 right now, which will... <clears throat> by our piercing arrow. And sorry for the Nicoria like, language on chat. Again, people don't really pay attention to what they're naming their people, really. They think of it as a joke. And my name is Tausman. Yeah, right. Oh, wait a bit. So let's go help them. Spawn, which is where I just was and where I was just trying to get away. So let's get this in here safe. And they're just laying there, unless this person wants to go hunting with me. Alright, they want to go hunting with me. Come on. Let's go. I make alliances with people sometimes, but low level people I don't tend to make alliances with because they don't really provide me with much don't provide much help when I'm fighting really strong people or really strong monsters. And a barbarian, there are four levels above me, but it looks like this little guy can do some leveling, so let's just stick with him. Now, have you come here in my direction? So that way, I'm just gonna keep looking around because normally, uh, when I'm out doing some hunting, I 
and get killed because the people that you know are on the leaderboard tend to come out and <coughs> hunt around these areas. So, if I go too close to the king, these monsters will go back to where they were before, and that's a pain in the butt. So I'm just gonna like they don't do much damage to me, so I don't have to worry about them killing me. But I did save myself once against Cockles, because Cockles was coming at me, and he was attacking me, and he does around a thousand damage per hit, and so I went into a field of level 74 monsters, and they killed me without taking my fame, because you can't take fame unless you're an actual player. So, keep having these guys, help this little guy level up. I can take them out though. Because they're only level 42. But these little guys might not be able to, so I might want to close back a little bit just to see. So I'd rather not have a kill on my watch. But let's kill them because it appears that they're trying to get some fame from my little friends. Over these little guys, basically. Once I lost almost my entire health to a bunch of level eights on the other team, which made me feel great. And then they killed me after that. Once a level forty like myself came and helped them. So, I'm the archer, and there's three other classes. There's mages, shamans, and, um, what are they called? Shaman. Oh, and warriors. Warriors get a lot of health, and, but, like, only can attack short range. And you only are given one weapon in this game, but I heard that there's going to be an update that might change that. So... Let's see. And I'm using my volley skill right now, like with the multiple arrows. But that person is doing damage that scares me. It looks like this little guy is They are level 47. So actually, they might be fine. So I'm just attacking all these guys. Actually, oh, I didn't go for a They are really good. I'm just going to take this off with my leech arrow, which, again, it says, look, it's not the description, but it heals you. Taking health from the other monster or player. But this one is for a Oh, Swordmaster, I've never seen this guy before. I put him on the chat, but I've not actually seen him in person. Oh, look at that, someone. Oh, Red, hey! I'm actually getting a few decent people helping me here. But who was that? Wait, is that what he said? Is that what I just want to do? Okay, that was traveling with 42. Okay, I'm just going to keep you because they're on my team. They don't have a silver crown unless they have trade. So I'm not going big here. I'm not going to try to get a crown until I'm level like, you know, 50. Because notice how all these guys are like level 50, 79. But that person's on my team, so I don't have to worry about them. So, like, I'm going to wait until level 50 or so and try to kill one of the bigger guys. Because I don't like losing fame. They lost so much fame. Oh my god, don't hate me. Okay. Uh, yeah, they killed them too. What are you doing? Being stupid. I'm just dropping over the main event. I'd love to save this guy. Come 
mind volume you can see. There's a certain cooldown on each skill, so after you use one, you have to be careful to, you know, retreat so it's ready, and you have to get it ready, so they cannot attack for me. And, frankly, I shouldn't be attacking either because I'm below their level, so, let's see. Dang it! We got too close to the king. Well, this will help us see again. We're probably about to get mobbed by a bunch of people. I mean, monsters, not people. I think we're going to go check on the farming situation here. There's this a difference between farming and hunting. Hunting, you just attack monsters. Farming, you, well, farm people to get the thing. And it looks like the bloodlust may have taken control of this field. Let's change that. Come on, you always come out of that bubble. You can't attack someone if they're in that bubble. So here we go. Wait, what? Not no. No, you're not no, you're not killing me. You're not doing like this. You're not doing like this. No, no. bottling that they're talking on the chat here is when you, I don't know, like something about making an AI to take care of your character and have it automatically farm people to get you fame. Yeah, it's pretty weird. I don't even know how they do it. I've never even tried anyway. I don't really want to cheat. Yeah, they do not get a good reputation either. Like, people will, you know, be mean to them. May or still talking to them. Come on here. Well, CB is sitting in the front. Sure. Alright. Well, it's kind of cowardly of me to attack people below my level, but it's really the only way you can get fame in this game because. If you don't attack people below your level, then you you can guarantee that you will get killed. And I have done a few 1v1s against a person called Life of Tyler and a person named Yay and I think um, Drago. Drago and I had a 1v1 and I ended up killing him. And since then we have been arch enemies, so Funny thing is, he's level 39 now with a silver helmet, and I am level 40 now with a silver helmet. And at one point, he was my exact same level, and we both had silver helmets, and this was before I had so much fame that if I got killed twice, I could still have my silver helmet. Oh, oh, okay, Red is here, Red is here, Red is here. We need to get out of here, because they would take so much of my fame if I got down. But at one point, Red was on the top of this leaderboard here. And Emma wasn't on the top of this leaderboard. And look at that, STB is now level 80. He could take on Emma. He would totally do one to one against her. But, does it look like we're just attacking anyone? Because I would call for help. I actually started a war once. Because I made an alliance with that guy, Life of Tyler, who I won to one against. And, oh, what you say? Ooh, Traveler, 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 level 49. Alright, that would be 
that. So let's run. Yeah, there's a full out war because my like, Tyler, I made a truce with him and he killed me. And he was like, I didn't know, but I was just like, truce mean, like, think before you kill. Oh, wait, who's that? Wait, whoa, whoa, oh no. Oh no, yep, yeah, I'm getting out here. Yep, that'd be Emma and that traveler. It looks like they're just going to kill me. I never announce my position on this game on the chat unless, like, there's a war going on and I've been killed multiple times because all my enemies will come running and it will also, you know, make my team have a disadvantage in the war. I'm sure we all love that. I'm still nowhere near to get anywhere in What? Come? Just come. Some people do not appreciate the uh, help I sometimes give them, or the being fairness. Oh, who's that? Yeah, let's get to some things before I can do the chat. I can't chat while attacking things, or retreating, or whatever I need to do, so... Let's just say Oh my god, with like, oh my, <laughs> with 60 health left, that was such a close game, and there's something going on in my background here, so I'm wondering what exactly that is, okay, never mind, I think it might just be my voice ricocheting off something, but whatever, so I killed someone above my level, I feel better now. And they were level 41, but I'm only level 40, so technically that wasn't too impressive. If they had been on level 50, that would have been impressive, but most of the time, when I kill at level 50, it's well with the help of someone above my level. So, let's just... Did I say anything on the chat? Yeah, I don't... apologize for killing someone, but since they were, like, I had a reason to kill them, and since that was a really close call, I'm just going to say sorry. And that's pretty good. I was slightly faster than them. I wonder if they lost their health. Let's kill that person. I actually might get a gold helmet. Well, everyone, that was today's game of Cordio, and I will be on again next time I get a chance to. So, play this game is really fun, but beware because leveling up really helps. So, if you don't level up, then make sure to because you will definitely pay for it in the long run. So, have fun playing this if you decide to. And good